News bringing you the fallout now from the Providence speed camera controversy. Several bills related to those new speed cameras going to be taken up at the state house today. Lawmakers looking to make changes after thousands of drivers slap with those $95 fines in the first few weeks of the program in Providence. Michaela McDonald live at the state house now with a preview. Patrick and Danielle, that controversial speed camera program will be a topic of discussion for the House Judiciary Committee today here at the State House. Representative Anthony Giarusso, senior deputy minority leader, is expected to testify before the House Judiciary Committee on a bill he has submitted to eliminate the traffic cameras. His legislation seeks to repeal the law that allows these cameras after more than 12,000 speeding tickets were given in the first month of the speed camera program in Providence and then thousands since then. Representative Giarusso released a statement saying these fines are simply attacks masquerading as a public safety initiative. And there are at least three other bills scheduled before the committee today as well. Among the changes proposed, better warning signs, including flashing yellow lights at the camera locations, a gradual penalty system that would include a warning for the first offense, and one of the bills proposes a maximum fine of $35, which is much lower than Providence's $95 fine. And there also has been a class action lawsuit against the city regarding these cameras that has been moved to federal court. And because of that lawsuit, some court appearances for some of the people who have received tickets have now been put on hold. Michaela McDonald, Eyewitness News.